Now, as an artist myself, I know what it's like to make a song and it sounds good, but it's just not hitting. Something about it, it's just not like, it's not what it could be. In 99.999% of the time, that just comes down to the master of the song. Mastering is a very underlooked thing. So in this video, I'm gonna show you guys this master plugin that I made that pretty much will help you master your songs and you can actually do some customization to it to overall make your songs sound a lot better. So I have these three songs that I made, so they're by me. <laughs> and I'm pretty much gonna show you the difference between a mastered song and a non-mastered song and how you could do the same for yourself too, which is, Awesome. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so we're in FL Studio for this video, but I have the Essential Master plugin here. All you really have to do to use it is download it off my website, logoner.com. I'll put the link in the description for you guys. And then you just drag it onto this master track right here. This thing will pop up. Look how beautiful this looks. Oh, that's the back end of it. Boom. <laughs> yeah, the back end is pretty intense. There's a lot going on, but it's all condensed into this. It's very digestible and like you can kind of understand what's going on. But one thing to pay attention to is this bypass button right here. Boom, boom. You can click that right there. That pretty much means on and off. So when it's clicked on, that means that there's no master plugin on it. So there's no effects on it. It's just raw. That's just how it sounds. And then when we flick it off, that means you're hearing the master plugin in you. So this is the song, uh, absolutely raw. It's not out yet. So a little snippet. I'll play it without any master on it. And then we turn the master on and ready? Right away, it just livens it up, ready? Turn it off. It's good. It's just not there yet, though, right? Right away, it just livens it up. We'll uh, we'll try playing with some of the effects and stuff like that on this next one so much. This one's out on SoundCloud. If you like the song I'm about to play, I have a whole video on how I made it, literally making it live and everything. It's pretty cool, so go check that out up there. But anyways, uh, let's go here. This is it. Off, right here. No master plugin. Three, two, one. Ah. So why, man? He's a mercy man. I'll play with some effects there. You could use this stuff for like transfers. That was hard. Uh, so we'll really play around over here. Let's just highlight right here for the one time, and let's do a automation clip right here, and we're going to just play around with it. Let's just try some random, something completely random. So we're gonna see that moving on its own. Set off, ready? Like it's good. The song is good, but it's just not hitting. You know what I mean? I'm going oh. crazy. Yeah, this money get conflicted. She going crazy. You can turn the bass down if you want. Like no bass if you want it. I don't know why you'd want that, but you know what I mean? Crazy bass. Obviously, you want to keep it within reason. Turn up the middle of it. That sounds really good. The high end. The soft clipper pretty much to make sure it doesn't clip. If you want it to clip, because that's that's a style that people like doing, then you can just turn that off like so. Now, obviously, it's not going to work on every single song, but you can always adjust it to fit your song. At the end of the day, it's like a preset plugin, you know what I mean? But with simple adjustments, you can make your song sound 10 times better. Low key, just kind of want to showcase some music and uh, show off the preset and run out the plugin. I'm not going to lie to you, I'm pretty sure there's a little sale going on just for that master plugin if you click the link below, but uh. That's just word on the street. <laughs> Anyways, fellas, it's been a Gunner. Uh, if you guys want any other videos, any video recommendations, put it down in the comment section. I gotcha. I'll do some tutorials or whatever the hell. And um, yeah, I gotcha. See ya. <laughs>